Derek, I can't find my scarf. It should be in my briefcase. But Derek, be serious now. I'm late. The only serious issue we have here is that we need a child. And we're not getting any younger. Derek, do I have to sleep and wake up to this? Listen, I'm not in for any quarrel today, seriously. You have to room to yourself. You won't spoil my day. I'll soon. my boyfriend of course my wife is still at home please go and come back later Derek no way no way come to think of it I haven't seen you for some days now why come to see you for what eh? it's my customer Jennifer the one I supply goods to mm. Jennifer this is my wife Mona Lisa Derek, step up your test. I need better things as competitors and not the sad old fool. She's definitely not going to give you your child. Except you're playing safe. How dare you? Don't you don't fight. Are you mad? You stop me. I'll do it over and over again. Okay? Hey, you, get out of my house. Get out of my house with me. Get out of my house with me. It's good to see you again. It's good to see you too, sir. Your late father was so good. Even if there is no vacancy in this place, I'll create a position for you. It is my duty. Well, I, I really don't intend to inconvenience you. Do I hear you say inconvenience? What for? You want it. I would rather be a fool if I let a brain like you go. Wow, that's so much of a compliment, sir. And I, I do appreciate it. Thank you. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Oh, so tiny. Sit down. Yeah. Thank you. Brother, this is Mr. Lover Jones. He is the senior brand manager of this company. And Mr. Lover Jones, you're meeting Brother Ede. Alright. She's going to work directly with you as our new brand manager of Product Press. Okay then. Huh. It's nice to meet you. Good. Well, sir, I actually brought this document so you can find uh, please. Oh, he's taking care of Yeah. Okay then. Okay then, excuse me. I'm in office. Brother? See you. Okay. So nice, man. <laughs> so, Big Boy asked the young lady to strip. <laughs> so, but when did this boy become yeah. a king? My please. Don't let him hear you say so. What is he gonna do? Um, there is nothing left for him than to hang himself. Um, but my prince. Thank you for the food you gave us inside. But that is not the reason why we are here. The main reason why we are here is that your father, Diwe, asked us to come and find out when is your wife actually going to get pregnant. Jerry, do not spoil the mood, please. My prince, it is essential for the safeguarding of your, the throne. Yes. You need a son to succeed your father, the Iwe. Listen, my father is still alive. And we are still young, so why the rush? My prince, the king himself asked us to come here and pay a visit. Yes. yes. He is curious and worried. Yes. He is worried. You know what? Tell the king that everything is all right. And soon things will happen. Mm, soon. When is soon? When is soon? Huh? My prince. But it is good for one to get a good advisor. We are very happy. We appreciate it. Thank you. 
Uh, we have to be going now. When will you get back to the village? We tell the king what we eat. I was hard. Let me do it now. I'm going to do it now. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. of Green Eyes PLC. You serious? Brand manager? <laughs> Seriously. I just had that promotion today. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. Well, I'm so happy for you. Mm. Well, of course we should celebrate. Of course we should. We should. I mean, this is so huge. Do you know how long I've waited for this day? I mean, I... Baby, I'm so happy for you. <laughs> Let me get glasses. Yeah, all right. Glasses. All right. Glasses. You know you're stingy though. You fuck, get out. Get out! As for. You want me to leave? Good. Okay. I'll leave. Fuck you! Fuck your mom! Fuck your dad! Fuck your generation! Fuck my bitch. mom! Fuck your mom! You are your mother fuck you! Bitch. I, fuck. I hate you! I hate you too! Rebecca. Mommy. Rebecca, this is not a good life. Oh, please, mom, don't start. Do you know, do you know what he did? Do, do you know what he did? What did he do? Do, do you know what he did to me? I want to cry. Do you fucking know what he did to me? Oh, it's okay. okay. Do you know he fucked me? Rebecca. Oh, mommy, stop this. He stop fucked this. me and he didn't give me money. Shouldn't I be angry? He fucked me. <laughs> I told you that tomorrow morning, you and I will go arrest him. DPO is my boyfriend. I own Potako. That guy doesn't know shit. I will treat his fuck up. I will treat it. Mom, don't worry. He's okay. I will treat it. <laughs> don't worry, Mom. Don't, don't be angry. <laughs> oh, Mom, he fucks well. Jesus, that guy is good. Thanks. How was the night? Very well. Good. Um, uh, how was your sister Mona Lisa? You know Lisa? Yeah, I know Lisa. She was my senior and, I, and um, high achiever at college. Yeah, back in the days. <laughs> well, I see. Well, she's very well. She's married now and living in Port Harcourt. Married? Oh, wow. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> what, what, what was that for? Well, why do people always give me this reaction each time I say my sister is married? Oh, well, more like the eighth word wonder, I must say. Anyway, I left work with your secretary, okay? <clears throat> we'll talk later. Okay. 
कोचेस के पिता है my signature on a project I have absolutely no idea of. Yeah, I've been working on this project for more than two months now and I think it's right for approval. You care what I think? But Barbara, you're new here and you will not understand. Maybe if I allow you to go through a dozen times, you still not understand. And besides, time is not in our favor. Hmm. Well, I very well understand the consequences of signatures. Therefore, I will not sign it. And if it's going to take me two years for me to understand whatever Swahili codes you have in there, only then will I sign it. And one more thing, I would like every detail of the project to breathe on my desk. Have a good day.
baby, I thought you work 9 to 5 and you have an office. <sighs> Sweetie, you know, sometimes eight hours is not enough for you to prove your worth. Especially when you occupy a position that is very competitive and quite challenging. Mm. You need to be on your toes. You want to talk about it? I would love to, but um, I'd rather not bore you. <laughs> but thanks all the same. So, uh, come, come and see this. Mm -hmm. What do you think about this design? I just created it. This um, one. I think it's okay. You think it's good? Yeah, well, it's, it's okay. It's, it's just okay. It's just good. It's good. No, no, no. Good is not good enough. I mean, this this has to be the best. This is my own design. Ah, look, just okay, fine. I think it's um very artistic, uh, very colorful. But you are the rest. <laughs> Thanks for your time. Okay. No problem. I see Heck, baby. Yeah. So how was your day? Oh, you're not asking me, are you? Oh, come on! Come on. What? I'll be upstairs. Oh. I'll, I'll meet you shortly. Sweetie. He looks so good. Really? Mm -hmm. You know I get this every time you give me such compliments. Okay, so tell me, what would you like to have for dinner when you return? Well, I think the last time the uh, chicken you did was good. Oh. But anything goes for me. I know exactly what to make for you, what? don't worry. Yeah. I'll let it be a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> you know something? Um, you're right. You're the best. Really? The best husband any woman could ever wish for. Um, that's why I love you. Could you, could you, could you, could you? Mm. Oh. What is that? <laughs> okay, now, I'll see you later. Okay, I'll see you when you return. Bye. Well, I do not agree with the changing of the name Breeze. Thank God I did not allow you to cajole me into signing it. Miss Barbara, you and I have a bit with the chairman in the next five minutes. We have to be agreed on whatever we are presenting. We do not need to make a presentation. We are not ready for it. It's not optional. It was called by the chairman himself. Like I said, we've been working on this project for more than two months now. <laughs> two months? Two months is precisely not enough for me to make a decision about changing the face of a product that's already existing. L -l 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 listen, listen, listen. I'm not here to fight or argue with you, okay? What I need you to do is to be reasonable. That's what I need you to be now, right now, okay? If it's not for me, for the sake of peace. It's not about you, Mr. Lover Jones. It's about making the right decision. It's about the perfection of Breeze as a product. And I am not going to compromise on that. Yes, hello, sir. Yeah, uh, uh, we, we, we'll be there in the next two minutes. Okay. The chairman's call. I just hope you know what you're doing. I want to surprise you. Yes. How are you? Okay. Bye. 
Bruce isn't doing badly. Right now, our competitors will give anything to see us out of the market. Why is that? Because they see us as a threat, which is a good thing. We realize the fact that Breeze as a brand needs some sort of retouch. And we as brand surgeons are ready to go into the theater to perform the operation, but not without caution. Because whatever decisions we take now will either make or mar Breeze as a brand. So I think the most important thing for us right now is to make the right decisions. I can say both of you are getting a long business wife. Thank you. Barbara. I seem to have so much trust in you. And don't let me down. You can take that to the bank, sir. <laughs> Both of you get along to see that you see Breeze to the next level. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Again. Oh, no. How dare you call my name? How dare you show your face around here again? Are you mad? I'm sorry. Sorry about what? About what? The fact that you chose to be screwed by my husband. Under my roof. On my own bed. Ah, God. Look at you. You're a married woman. How can you do this to another family just because they are having crisis? Leave my house. Right now. I don't want to ever see you around here again. I said she get out of my house. What are you standing for? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't know you in person. But I realized that when I woke up and saw you in tears. Please, I'm sorry. I promise to give up on your husband. I'm sorry. Listen, uh, <clears throat> that was quite impressive, okay? I, I let you have it. Quite. Uh, you know, we need to do more than just talking and talking, you know. <laughs> Mr. Rosa called. He wants a meeting in respect to the bridge rebranding. Um, White Waters request a meeting. Booking says Friday, preferably. Mr. Prince Edia called. He says you should call him back. It's urgent. That is all. Okay, thank you. You can go. Thank you. Hey, babe. Uh, sweetie, it's, it's not yet my closing time. You know, honey, I know that if I say that I was not expecting them, it may not come out really right, but please try and understand. I mean, this is not my company. 
I cannot just walk in and out as I like and... Oh, hello? Hello? Jane. Jane? Okay, listen, um, cancel all my appointments for the day. And if any member of the board call, finds me, just tell them that I'm in a meeting. Okay, get back to me on my cell. Alright? Yeah, thanks. and tired. What kind of job did I hear you picked? <clears throat> My husband the king will not take that. And I on his behalf will not condone it. Barbara my dear, we have more pressing issues to bother about than stalking yourself behind an office desk. Prince, why did you allow it? Come on mama. The house is big. It will just kill her of boredom. Besides, she's she's a graduate from London School of Economics. Are you trying to tell me of what I have already known? Barbara, if you are bored, come to my palace. Let's put our heads together. Eh? I don't know why both of you love staying in the, in, in the city. Uh, Mama, I'm, I'm sure you had a tiring journey and I'm sure you're hungry. Let me get you something to eat and prepare where you'll rest. When I have less around. Prince, I hope you are preparing for the palace. Let me get you something to eat. Excuse me. <laughs> So 
them go they think say Tim I had to do Ah, see that, call me motherfucker Before them me call me motherfucker Right now, I don't got many other Back then, when I tell you say so Everything when I do for my life, my say you don't concern you Anyway, I'm gonna have a cut with my life, my brother you don't concern you You don't know me, I shit for my nigga Hey, you don't concern you You don't concern you Concern you, me gonna leave me here Yeah, my brother, my damn name, my name Hey, God, you don't bless me, tell me, my guy, why I don't go Hey, hey, God, you are too much, yeah, yeah, hey, God, you are too much, yeah, yeah to go anywhere anywhere i don't care <sighs> well you know i'm all she's got huh why do you want her to go you have to choose between me and that girl just calm down let's settle this and make everything i'll be in the car Disrupted their sleep, I guess. Uh, Mother, don't say that. I'm sure whatever it is you want to say must be very important. My dear, you are the daughter I never had. I must say that I'm proud to have you as a daughter in law. My son loves you with all his heart, and he has done a lot of sacrifices right from the day he married you to a death. My husband is sick. And God forbid if anything happens to him, 
that throne will be lost forever. A prince cannot succeed his father's throne without a son. And my son knows all this. I don't want to do anything about it. It is your duty to help him. Uh, how, mother? Force him to marry another wife. Uh, you mean I should force my own husband to marry a second wife? If he loses that throne because of your inability to give him a son, you will ever live to regret it. And you will not be happy again. My heart is on fire. Would do I explain my fears to you? My whole life is burning. It's like I'm going off my mind. I don't wanna leave him for that another. I don't wanna give no girl a chance. And I'll do all it takes to stay put. And I'll do all I can for a child. Cause I've got desperation A life just cannot end With determination A man will stay as mine oh, So many, many mysteries, mysteries. So many, many desires I'm So many, many tastes of waters Big, big wildlife So many, many mysteries, mysteries. Desire has taken charge. The girl that I once knew stabbed me in the face. Complications here and there, the secrets fill the air. Abomination grows by day. It is seems that all is well, and I say, Mama, I don't wanna get to drown. And I say, No, no. You're gonna fight it down No matter who they do Every other thing All I know my mind is mine No matter what it takes I'm ready for this I'm gonna go for him my love So many many mysteries, mysteries. So many many desires Desire. So many many tastes of waters Big big wild So many many mysteries
girl is an ingrate. I've tried my possible best to be a good father to her. You are not my father. You are not my father. You can never be my father. Shut up. You hear me? Who wants to be a father to a daughter like you? Derek, stop it. Stop what? Talk to your daughter. Hey, me bastard. Your mother, your father, your entire generation are millipede. Idiot. That's what you are. You know. You're a shameless, useless man. Idiot like you. You are leaving my house today. Go and pick everything. You are leaving my house today. Derek, you shouldn't have called her a bastard. Listen, you have your daughter, I don't even know who it was. I don't know! Derek? 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 Alright. Yes, so I'll come and see you tomorrow and then we can talk about whatever it's today. I didn't say anything. You know what? Let's just cut this thing short, alright? Yesterday I was at home the whole day, you didn't see anything. You didn't even come and see me. You were supposed to discuss the whole business thing, but you didn't show up. Right, but see, that is why I said I was... Okay, you know what, just cut it short, I'll come and see you tomorrow and we'll talk about it, okay? Okay, alright, okay, I'll see you later. I don't remember I was having a fight. I, I thought we were happy. But of course we are. Are we? Are you sure? Where is all this thing from? <sighs> Your mother asked that I allow you to take another wife. Is that why you're not happy? Your mother's request doesn't sound like a surprise. You're not shocked. I mean, it feels like this whole thing had already been rehearsed. And yet she did not have the nerves to say it to me. She had to be the one to deliver it. My mother is just concerned about the throne. Oh, please don't, don't even try to play that perfect husband with me because it would not work. How can you just admit it? Crazy, this is what you want. You just don't have the nerves to say it to me. Why could you say it to me? My father's ill. I could lose the throne. When a woman needs a child, she does something. So do something! This, this is not my fault. Go and get dressed. You're going to see my mother off. Now. This, this is all me. It, it, it's all my fault. I'm waiting. You're not telling us. Calm down, calm down. Calm down? Doctor, how can you even begin to tell me to calm down? You don't have an idea of what I'm going through. Why am I not even getting pregnant in the first place? Why? If you say nothing is wrong with me, why am I not getting pregnant? Okay, tell me, what is the joy of marriage without a child? I'm losing everything. My husband. You cannot be saying anything. Papa, you need to be strong. Okay, just be strong. Anxiety is the last thing you need now. I am very sure, I ran the test, I am very sure that there's nothing wrong with you. You only need a little bit of prayers and patience. I'm very sure you'll be okay. Or is the prince putting you under pressure? Just I am I'm tired. Don't be, you don't need to be tired, okay? And make sure you don't do anything stupid. Be strong. I know you come over it. Don't be so Think of a test What is the problem? What is it? What is the problem? Why am I not even getting pregnant? Why? If I'm fine, so why am I not pregnant? You tell me. Ten years. Ten years. And from the look of things, I'm still counting. My mother-in-law should have just told me to pick a wife instead of asking me to allow him to pick another one. 
and I'm sure you would have just picked me. Zara, <laughs> come be mine. Oh, Bobby, please don't do this. Barbara. I don't know where else to go to. I don't know what else to do. The doctor said that nothing is wrong with me and that we are all fine. And I'm losing my husband's love. You know, I know this may sound very absurd, but it might be of help to you. Have you ever heard of Mountain Seven? Where is that? Okay. There's this mountain. <laughs> at Ilesh. Like it's so high. And um, there's a prophet there. He's called um, Prophet Elijah. Everyone calls him the god of babies. His specialty is on women and pregnancy. You know, I don't know. If you might be interested, then I'm interested. I okay. Just, uh, just who's that? Uh, um. Hey, Lisa. Madam. So if I don't call, you won't call, right? Eh? Oh, Lisa, please, please. Look, I, I have my own issues. Okay. Besides, I know you're fine. Um, how's my lovely in-law doing? He's fine. Okay, and my girl. Your girl had a fight with Derek. He wants her out of the house. Wow, you, you don't mean it. Becca is in helping issues. She's dropped out of school. Baba, please. I want her to come stay with you. Uh, no, no, um, Lisa, I mean, I... Oh, Lord, um... Babe, I have to discuss that with my husband. I mean, it's not a decision I can just take on, on my own. You know, but, but how? I mean, how the hell did you allow that girl get out of hand like, like that? I blame you, you know. I'm sure you see yourself in that girl. Please, Miss Goody, don't just start. Please. Oh, yeah, right. I won't start. Look, I'll have to get back to you, babe, okay? Bye. Oof. Seems like Mona is having a problem with her daughter. Becca just dropped out of school. Exactly what Lisa did years ago. Mona Lisa. Babes, please. I have to go now. We'll have to see later. Okay, girl. Okay, we talk about that. Just don't forget, okay? I'm, 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 I'm hold my breath. Take mm -hmm. care. <laughs> All right, babe. Yeah. Thanks. Mrs. Barbara, I was here earlier and I was informed that you weren't on seat. That is not good for this company, you know. Please, just cut out the Mrs. Bullshit, okay? Talk to the cheese. What do you want? I've got a job to do. And I hope your zeal for Breeze hasn't died after putting out those splendid performance at the chairman's office the other day. Look, I cannot remember working with you, for you or under you. Under, precisely. No, I'm the brand manager here. I am not answerable to you, okay? Okay, okay, it's all right. Let's not argue. I did not come here so we can fight. Listen, we can, we've got a job to do, and the best we can do now is to show a little concern. And who says I'm not showing concern, huh? Who? Look, I have a lot on my mind. I am going through a lot, and the last thing I need is you breathing down my neck, so give me a break! A lot? <laughs> I see. Mind the business. Damn. I quite agree with the fact that Breeze needs some sort of rebrand. Okay, but then the question is what is it about Breeze as a product that is not working? I would say that the bottling is the problem because the bottling is quite masculine. What, um, Miss Barbara, without due respect, I don't see nothing wrong with bottling. 
I mean, this bottling you feel like so much condemned was designed and produced by experts in China. I think what we should be talking about here is uh, the change of name. Yeah. What? Mr. Lover, are you serious? Change of name? Uh, what would you rather it be called, huh? Oh, I get it. I, I, I think we should try something like, um, Lover Perfume. Mm. <laughs> Mr. Lover, do you realize the importance, the power of a name? It's like changing the entire face of a product, starting all over again. Thereby giving people room to start thinking that we are not sure of what the future holds. Breeze, as a name is, it is so sensuous. You know, it's, it's a sensual name, it's quite feminine. The bottling is where we have the problem, because the bottling is totally masculine. I am a lady, so I should be able to tell you that Breeze is quite suitable for this product. The problem is the bottling. Look, Miss Barbara. I think you're not in the right position to tell out what Breeze needs. Considering the fact that for the past few weeks you've been greatly troubled over some personal issues, okay? And we've not been taking our job seriously. What? Yes. So I think you need to go home, do your, your, your calculation very well, and then before you come to a conclusion. I've heard enough. I quite agree with Barbara that we need a rebuttling. I also share with the view that the name needs to be retouched. Both of you could go on now and begin to think of something good. This time, not as opponent, but as a team. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You're not sorry? You're not sorry for anything, okay? You see me as a threat. That why you're ready to do anything to get rid of me. I give you one piece of information about me. One! And what did you do? You used it against me in a board meeting. Well done! I mean, how cruel can you be? How, how cruel? I don't need your position, okay? So do not panic. I don't need it. Just allow me to do my freaking job. That's why I get paid. And get off my back. Across the room, you hear me walk by. Open your eyes and see our little love life. The reason I found you is so I make you mine. My heart goes wide, cause I know you are my love. It is pure, natural, the love I have for you. It is sure, all around. I say, love is life, it grows to perfection. Yeah, love is life, love is life, it takes your emotions. Love is my life, love is life, it grows to perfection. Yeah, love is life, love is life, it takes your emotions. Oh.
tell me you were leaving. You were sleeping. I didn't want to disturb you. You know what? The whole house is in disarray. Just I will. I will. Okay. Yeah. Listen, okay, my room, especially, you need to really take care of it. And then tidy the living room. And please, if you're going out, I help feel. me lock up the doors, okay? Uncle! Yeah. Uncle, want to ask for something. Something like? Apple. Apples? <laughs> All right, uh, I'll get you up. Who's that all? Before you barge into my office, use the intercom. Please. What? I'm here to say I'm sorry. Sorry for what? For everything. I mean, my attitude and every other thing. Mm. I'll see if it won't happen again next time. No, you won't. Trust me. So, can I <clears throat> get a smile on your face and a handshake? I get it. I'll leave my office. It's okay. Listen across the room, you hear me walk by. Open your eyes and see a little love life. The reason I found you is so I'll make you mine. My heart goes wide. Cause I know you are my love It is pure, natural The love I have for you It is sure, all around Every day I say Love is life It grows to perfection yeah, Love is life Love is life It takes your emotions Love is my life Love is life Love is life, love is life It takes your emotions high Your love blossoms, blossoms Blossoms like a flower My heart jumps up It jumps into the sky when I think about your beauty, I'm glad you came my way. When I look around and see you, I see you are mine for real. Your love is life, love is life, it grows to perfection. Love is life, love is life, it takes your emotion. Your love is my life, love is life, it grows to perfection. Your love is mine. Love is life, it takes your emotions high. Love is life, it grows to perfection. Yeah, love is life, love is life, yeah, love is my it life. takes your emotions yeah, Love is mine, love is life, it grows to perfection. Yeah, love is mine, love is life, it takes your emotions oh, love is mine. Love is my life. grows to perfection. Love is my life. Love is life. Yeah, love is mine. It takes your emotions. Yeah, love is mine. Love is life. Yeah, love is mine. It grows to perfection. Love is.
Papa, when did you come back? Well, not long ago. Okay, so what's up? Give me a hug. Yeah, how are you doing? <laughs> I'm okay. You must be tired, eh? Yes, I am um, actually. Um, Becca! What, what, Becca! What are you calling Becca for? Oh, I left everything downstairs. My bag, my files. I need to just get everything from... Don't worry, I'll, I'll do that for you, okay? You... Uh, uh, you... is on fire who do I explain my fears to my whole life is burning it's like I'm going off my mind I don't wanna leave him for another I don't wanna give no girl a chance and I'll do all it takes to stay put and I'll do all I can for a child Cause I've got desperation My life just cannot end With determination A man will stay as mine Oh, So many, many mysteries mystery. So many, many desires Desire. So many, many tastes of waters Big, big wahalala So many, many mysteries Mystery. So many, many desires Desire. So many, many tastes of waters Big, big disaster An evil desire has taken charge Take it easy, okay? Just take the girl easy. that I once knew has stabbed me in the face Complications here and there and secrets fill the air Abomination grows by day Yet it seems that all is well And I say no, no I don't wanna get to drown And I say no, no I'm sure gonna fight it down No matter who they do Every other thing All I know my mind is mine No matter what it takes I'm ready for this I'm gonna go for him, my love. So many, many mysteries. Mystery. So many, many desires. Desire. So many, many tastes of waters. Big, big wahala. So many, many mysteries. So many, many desires. Desire. So many, many tastes of waters. Big, big disaster. My heart is on fire. Who do I explain my fears to you? My whole life is burning It's like I'm going off my mind I don't wanna leave him for another I don't wanna give no girl a chance And I'll do all it takes to stay put And I'll do all I can for a child Cause I've got desperation A life just cannot end With determination A man will stay as mine oh, So many, many mysteries mystery. So many, many desires Desire. So many, many tastes of waters Big, big wahala So many, many mysteries mystery. So many, many desires Desire. Uncle, 
Ecco. Eh? They're watching TV. Yes. Graham, I brought you a drink. But do you drink alcohol? Uh, no, Uncle. I don't. But I um, heard that men like drinking alcohol. So, you know you're alone. You just said I should bring it. How are you preparing for a job? <sighs> Uncle Fine, no. I've been reading and um, reading all the time I read. Uh. Uncle, hmm? don't you like the drink? Oh, uh, I, I do, but uh, you know, I took some medicine, so I cannot really drink. Can I drink for me? Yeah, hold on. The room, you hear me walk by. Open your eyes and see how little love life. The reason I found you is so I make you mine. My heart goes wide, cause I know you are my love. It is pure, natural. The love I have for you, it is sure all around. I say, love is life, it grows to perfection yeah, Love is life, love is life, it takes your emotions Love is my life, love is life, it grows to perfection yeah, Love is life, love is life, it takes your emotions oh. I'm here. Me? Me? No, I mean her. Oh. Okay, you. Off your shoes. Sit down. Who is she? Who? She. I mean... She's my friend. She's like a sister. She needs a child. <laughs> no, she's not even married yet. I'm the one who needs a son. Uh, Please, when is the prophet going to attend to us? My daughter, it's a thing of luck. Some women even stay a month here. And some two days. Oh, oh no, no, no. Look, I, listen, I... Actually, I, I can't stay here for long at all because I, I have a job. Those women that want fishes stays here a month or thereabouts. But those that are in a hurry usually get snakes and crocodiles. Uh, what, what, what does that mean? I, I, I don't understand. Don't you know that the prophet gives you give children? They are usually fishes, snakes and crocodiles. What? Wait, wait. And he says that's where all of us come from. And the worst form of a child is snakes. Because they always fell sick 
and die at 20 or thereabouts. Well, hold on, I, I don't I, understand. I, are, you, are, you, are you telling me that I am going to have snakes, fishes or crocodiles as, as children or in, in human form? Fishes last longer, but they hardly get married. Jesus Christ! Zara! Why? Get me out of here! Let's leave this place now. You tell them all these women here are fools. Sarah, let's go. Eh? Anyway, fish, crocodile. I have a mother in law that puts you under pressure. And I don't think you even want to have a child. What do you think is wrong with her? I she had the ugly truth. Ugly truth? Yeah. Which is what? Just hold on. I'm about to give you some. Okay. Yes. That is my card. My name is Winnie. Give it to her, make sure she calls me. Okay. Barbara! Mama, should I come in now? Yes, come in, my daughter. Off your shoes. Sit down. How are you, my daughter? I do not deserve what is happening to me. I don't. For Christ's sake, look at me, look at me. Just look at me. Mona Lisa was a rebellious one. Yet she had a child of her own. But what about me? No hope. Then I have to come to mountains and prophets and have fishes as babies. Okay. For Christ's sake, I don't it's deserve okay. it. It's okay. It's okay. I know, but I just wish I could help. I wish there was something else I could do. Eh? What did the woman say? <laughs> Everything I don't believe. Everything I don't believe in, I have to do because I'm not a child. This is not fair. No, you ran down from the mountain because you didn't believe in whatever was going on there. That's why you came down. So how can you say that you're doing the things that you don't believe in? All right, you have your own children, you have your own kids, someone that will call you mom. When? When? Tell me when. The lady I was talking with, the lady, her name is Winnie. She said I should give you this card. My heart is on fire, would do I explain my fears to you? My whole life is burning, it's like I'm going off my mind I don't wanna leave him for another I don't wanna give no girl a chance And I'll do all it takes to stay put For a child Cause I've got desperation A life just cannot end With determination A man will stay as mine oh, So many, many mysteries Mysteries So many, many desires Desire. So many, many tastes of waters Big, big wildlife So many, many mysteries Mysteries Desire has taken charge. The girl that I once knew stabbed me in the face. Complications here and there, the secrets fill the air. Abomination grows by day. Yet it seems that all is well. And I say, in my mind, I don't wanna get to drown. And I say, no, no. You're gonna fight it down No matter who they do Every other thing All I know my mind is mine No matter what it takes I'm ready for this I'm gonna go for him my love So many many mysteries Mystery. So many many desires Desire. So many many tastes of waters Big big wild So many many mysteries Desire. So many, many tastes of waters, big, big desires. Wow.